Yes, call you racist. And we both black. Racist? And that's what I told you. No, no, when we first started. No, sir, I'm never talking about none. Of, I'm not talking. You're the one that brought up your accent. I didn't even, like, I'm not even worried there about that. There you go. You see? I got you again. Bitch, you brought up by that. You, you brought just called about my accent. Why you, you going to talk about my accent now, sir? Well, that was part of a recorded traffic stop between a state trooper and a college senior. The situation is now part of an internal investigation. You be the judge. Did the trooper go too far? Jason Marks is here with a special report. Jason? Anita, when we first watched this video, it almost appeared as if it had to be fake. But it was very real. And the college student who recorded this traffic stop wants to know why it happened. You're doing the wrong thing and you're doing the right thing at the same time. A New Year's Eve traffic stop that can only be described as bizarre for Old Dominion senior Kevon Robinson. You know, I thought I was being punked at first, and then when it when the conversation continued, it's just like, man, like this guy is really kind of kind of out there. Robinson was on his way to work when he was pulled over on Interstate 64 in Chesapeake by State Trooper Isa Ibrahim. I was like, what in the world could he possibly be stopping me for? He pulled out his cell phone. This man is holding me up. I got a cop right now. The next 10 minutes are some of the strangest you'll hear. Is there a reason why I got pulled over? Oh, you want me to tell you what? You want one or you want a bunch? Uh, I kind of want. I just want a reason. I you just want one? Ah, the first one is just right there. You look over there. You see that inspection stick in front of you? Yeah. It expired like 60 days ago. Okay. But what happens next is something Robinson still can't stop thinking about. You want me to keep going because if I keep going, I'm going to write you for everything I'm going to say. Well, why are you being so rude to me? I didn't do anything no, wrong. No, no, no. You see, you, you going to say that. I'm not being rude. I'm telling you the question you ask me. So I'm answering you that question. He seemed a little crazy, you know, but luckily I kept my cool. I'm not really sure how. You, you hear my accent? Yeah. You know I'm not from here, right? So you see, that's so, that's so messed up for you. Because I was born in Africa. Do you understand? So whatever's going on between you and the police in this country, guess what? I'm an immigrant. But I don't have nothing ah, to do. No, no, no. I'm now you, get, you, be, you be get. racist to me now. Yes, because you just be rude to me now. I'm no way, nowhere near racist, you know, and I thought that was a pretty strong statement for him to make. You sir, you gave me 30 minutes, sir. Sir, how about you get out of the vehicle, sir? So you see, that's not good, right? Ah, I'm just joking right now, so that's not good. Robinson filed a complaint and state police began an internal investigation. However, state police sent 10 on your side this email letting us know the outcome or any part of that investigation is not public record and will not be released. I'm looking for Trooper Ibrahim. 10 on your side went to Ibrahim's home twice. We even left a card, but he never called us back. I didn't think this was a proper way to conduct himself. Let's start over again. Keep everything. Good morning, sir. Good morning. You got your license on you? Yes, sir. Can I have it? Yes, sir. So the reason why I stop you is for your registration. Do you know the, why you didn't fix it? Um, no, I actually have an appointment this weekend to go get it fixed. So I, I've been working all day. I mean, all week. I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, yeah. Let's do it again and again, but that excuse is not good either. Sir, how you doing? How you doing? You got your license on you? Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Ibrahim did end up letting Robinson go with only a warning. I would definitely remember for a long time. Uh, I'll just say that. It's not something that I would like to remember, though. So as we said, state police are not releasing anything dealing with the investigation, including if the trooper was disciplined. We also asked state police if there have been any other complaints against Ibrahim, and they would not comment on that either. If you want to watch that video in its entirety, go to wavy.com. Jason Marks, 10 on your side.